Hi everyone. Is it too late to make a video about New Year's resolutions? Maybe it is, but uh, I've not been feeling quite uh, myself in the beginning of the year. Needed some time to recover after holidays, but now I'm back and I am excited for the new year. I usually don't really make resolutions. I make something like a letter for myself. Hey, money. Hey, say hi, Gato. Gatita. That's my new cat. So I usually just make a letter for myself and then I um, read it in the end of the year and kind of try to understand what I was thinking and what I wanted to achieve that year. And usually it is pretty close because um, <laughs> before a lot of things that I had were to do with um, travel and I love traveling and it's something that I was able to do for the most part of my life. Uh, but this year I'm trying a new approach. I was recommended by my colleague who was also my coach. And um, this is basically a, um, a mind map of um, images that you subconsciously or consciously find attractive. And um, I usually prefer to do things digitally but this one I want to put um, on next to my desk to inspire me so here it is uh, a lot of these things are about uh, travel so I would like to travel to Croatia and also maybe somewhere to the north like to Iceland that's why this uh, beautiful uh, hairy cow or yak is here there is a lot to do with the garden and gardening and this is uh, and food preservation. This is something I have been passionate about. Then uh, a lot of the things are have to do with the house because we want to do some renovation hopefully this year. And then in the middle is something about personal development, which has to do with hopefully finally getting my driving license and then having time for wellness, for relaxation and getting back into photography and into doing yoga as well. Overall, the uh, overarching theme for this year is um, taking care of my health because uh, last December I was very, very sick. I got very sick before going on holidays and I realized that I've been taking my health for granted in a way that uh, I, I'm young and I have been sick a lot, um, but then a uh, simple uh, um, flu made me very, very sick and very unhappy about that. So this year I want to do more exercise, uh, and also pay attention to my mental health and also hopefully you know do more often the checkups um go to the optometrist you know get some new lenses and get uh, new eyeglasses and stuff like that so this is my personal goal for this year last year i kind of made a year for my career i was uh, working with a mentor and also with a coach and i think i achieved some of my career goals so uh, this is why this year I am taking care of myself. I have uh, several um, tips I wanted to tell you about. I was just looking through, just browsing through Apple Store and find, found some um, new apps to install. One of the apps that uh, caught my attention was the app called I Am. This is an app with daily affirmations. You can select a category, for example, attract love, think positive, control st stress and anxiety. My personal favorites are self-care, love yourself, body positivity, and stop overthinking. And then you get a notification for the affirmation. For example, the uh, I remain grounded and rooted despite any stress or anxiety that attempts to creep up on me. I wake up and choose to think positive. Every passing day, I feel more relaxed and calmer. 
I make decisions from a grounded, centered place. I'm reading my mind of negative thoughts and filling it with positive ones. This has been helping me a lot. I actually, uh, after trying this app for um, three days, I uh, even bought this app. It's not sponsored, it's just something that I uh, like doing. And another app that is completely for free is called Worry Dolls. It's uh, also an uh, exercise for your mental health and for your mind. So you go to Worry Dolls and then you create a doll and then you tell the doll what you're worried about. I'm worried because I'm afraid I'm not successful. And then I tell her the worry and then she says, now this worry is with me. If you need to tell me anything or want me to stop worrying, just tell me. This is a mental exercise just that helps me to put my worries away and by you know, typing them up and telling them to a doll, I feel already better, like I shared this worry with someone. And the last um, application that I wanted to recommend is uh, called Blinkist. A lot of people, when they talk about self-development and uh, getting better, succeeding in your job or just reading up on things, they recommend you a lot of books, um, a lot of non-fiction books. And I don't really like reading non-fiction, to be honest. And this is a very good app for people like me who prefer uh, fiction. This is basically like listening to an to a podcast or an audio book, but they take one certain book and make short blinks about it. So they could be 15 to 30 minute lo minutes long, which you can listen during your commute or working out or cleaning. I have been listening to a lot of books uh, that have to do with self-development, but also um, modern intersectional feminism and uh, climate change. I bought the premium version for this year and I actually have a giveaway. <laughs> this membership allows me to add one more uh, device and I wanted to give it away for anyone. Uh, if you're interested, please um, subscribe uh, and comment on my channel that you subscribe and then I will uh, after a couple of uh, days or weeks, I'm going to randomly chain, cha uh, randomly select with whom to share this membership. It's um, $79.99 per year, so uh, it's connected from 19th of January, so you can have it until uh, 18th of January 2024. So let me know if you're interested. <laughs> That's a giveaway uh, that I wanted to do. I hope you are excited for the beginning of the year and I hope you are uh, going to have a great time. Uh, once again, if you want to take a part in your giveaway, please subscribe and comment on this video. Thank you so much for watching. And as all YouTubers and vloggers are supposed to say, uh, please like this video, subscribe and hit the notification bell. Bye!